payback time. Droid District is the place for me. Robo living is the life for me. Uh, no one's gonna understand that reference, but whatever, I don't care. Someone might, who knows. Uh, anyways, yeah. Black Series 6-inch Battle Droid. This is a thing that came out very recently, and believe it or not, even though I don't really collect 6-inch Black Series anymore, I could not pass up on a 1 12th scale Battle Droid figure. I didn't get around to getting the SH Figure Art, I didn't get around to getting the Bandai model kit, so I figured, hey, let's get the 6-inch Black Series, let's also review it for my new Droid District Series, whoa! And let's see if it's uh, any good. Spoiler alert, it actually is. So, a quick comparison first and foremost, here it is with the 6-inch Black Series clone trooper uh, I, I i i didn't think battle droids were this tall but apparently they are i don't know man it's it's a little a little goofy situation in uh in scale land another comparison here it is with the tvc battle droid uh, hasbro's latest three and three quarter inch effort he's he's not too uh big of a fan of standing up but yeah there it is with the tvc one and i'm just i'm just curious here's the the commander i got from caden you can see look it's like the three and a quarter inch ones are about the same size. So why is the why is the six inch one so much bigger? I don't know. Uh, it's it's probably accurate. Anyways, though, nice figure. I really do like it. Let's take a look at those details because he is a detailed black. He's a black figure from the black. I don't like when people just call it Star Wars black. Star Wars black what? Huh? Star Wars black helmet. Please elaborate! Anyways, uh, yeah, his eyes, they look nice, they're black. Um, BLACK! Anyways, <laughs> he's, uh, um, this eye was misaligned on the one I got, so I had to redo it myself. I don't know if you can notice or not, you probably can a little bit. Oh no! Um, <laughs> anyways though, yeah, the, the weathering's nice on it. I do indeed enjoy it, because the thing is, uh, battle droids, you don't really need to do much painting. They're, they're a matte tan. In universe, they are just painted tan. All you need to do is do some silver for the joints. Boom. Uh, maybe some weathering if you choose to. Boom. Uh, and I really like the weathering because it kind of reminds me of all those uh, Phantom Menace droid variants. But yeah, you've got the backpack there. It's looking nice and weathered. It's just got the details you need, man. A little silver there. A little, little uh, feet. <laughs> there, there isn't too much else to say. The gun looks nice. Really like battle droid blasters. They just look good. Then moving it off to the side, you see the rest of the torso. And right there, it's looking uh, nice, man. I don't know what else to say. Anyways, uh, let's move on to the other accessories. So, of course, you have the droid blaster. He holds it very nicely. And, of course, you have the droid backpack. And this can actually condense, even though I'm horrified to do it. It just pushes down. I think it's in the package push down. But yeah, there you go. You can just push those antennae down, or antennae, or antennas. I never remember which one it is. Someone's going to let me know in the comments, and I will promptly not care. Anyways, you have the Commander Antenna too. Uh, I really appreciate that. I don't know if any regular battle droids ever really used this, but I really do appreciate the fact it's included, because you could just repaint this into a Commander, and you don't have to worry about custom building your own Commander Antenna, because it's already there. Uh, you can put it in the other, uh, the other hole, but it's supposed to be in this one. Uh, yeah, that looks really cool. I like that. I think we need repaints of this ASAP. I would probably buy all of them. Uh, yeah, it's it's nice little accessories there. Anyways, let's get on to Articulate, because it does articulation, of course. I don't know what's up with me mispronouncing words today. That's just my shtick. That's my shticulation. Anyways, you have a ball joint at the base of the head there, uh, which gives you all of the rangulars you're really looking for. You have the little... I, I, I don't know. Uh, you also have this. If you're looking to make your battle droid look like um, that that guy. The <laughs> Yarl Poof. That's the guy I was thinking of. You do that so you can fold the head down and you make it look a little better. You also have a hinge and swivel there so you have even more range. Most articulated droid head from Hasbro for sure. You have really nice ball hinges at the shoulders. They can turn 90. Then you can also rotate the, the that part of the body. You can also do this. Uh, I apologize for my complete incoherentness today. You're just I'm just talking now. You're just looking at me move it. Yeah, man. I don't know what's up with me in my whole life. I just try my best to speak like a normal human being, and every single time I fail epically. 
yeah, I hope you uh, are enjoying this little articulation rundown while I am completely rambling on about the uh, intricacies of my life and the fact that I am a complete failure in it. Uh, yeah, there we go. There's a little rotation there and then also an ankle pivot, even though it's a little risky. It's a risky, risky business. But yeah, there there we go. There's the articulation. You can get him looking like, huh? Who who decided it would be a good idea to make uh make the Domino's pizzas um not shaped like Domino's? I don't know. I <laughs> I try my best and I don't succeed. I get what I want, but not what I need. <laughs> Anyways, I think I think that's pretty much it. Uh, I just feel obligated to show you. You can ball them up. You uh, you take the gun and then you plug it in. You have this plug here. You can either plug it like this, which I don't believe is correct. It could be though, but I don't believe so. I believe you do it like this. Question mark uncertainty arises. But yeah, you just put it like that, and then you just take his arms and you make him hug himself. Because, you know, he's he's a scared little boy, and he needs someone to help him before the clones come and, you know, take his family away. Because he's going to be sad. There we go. Black, Black Star Wars Black, Battle Droid, everybody. Uh, it's it's a good one. I actually think it's a good one. If you're a fan of the, the Battle Droids, of the prequel movies, of the... Uh, the clone troopers, and you need your clone troopers to beat up on somebody weaker and not as impressive as them, aka make your clone troopers into the bullies they are, here you go. Uh, get yourself a 6-inch battle droid available in stores. Um, probably not because, I mean, we're Hasbro we're talking about, but yeah. Available to purchase probably from somewhere. Uh, I do like this guy. I would, I would say he's... Uh, a, a nice, a nice item. I'm gonna make him give back our past.